Today we are making German Senfgurken, that's mustard pickles. They are semi-sweet and here's how you make them. You need cucumbers. Peel these guys and we slice them into nice chunks. I'm just gonna quarter this one and I'm gonna cut it into like inch pieces. Next step is you need to slice an onion. And I'm just cutting this into like half rings. And there we go. With all the slicing and dicing out of the way, we are gonna salt our cucumbers now. For that we take a coarse salt, like a kosher salt or a sea salt. And we go in with about two tablespoons, somewhere around there. We quickly mix this up. And then we put this in a colander and just let it drain. So maybe let this sit for an hour or two and in the meantime we have time to prepare our brine. For the brine, these are three pints of a water and vinegar mixture. So that's half vinegar, half water. I am gonna add maybe a quarter teaspoon of calcium chloride, which makes these things a little bit more crunchy. I am tossing in three little bay leaves. These are fresh bay leaves. Of course, you can use the dried ones, that's no problem. And then the more important things, these are 60 grams of salt or two ounces of salt. And 200 grams of sugar. That's about six and a half to seven ounces of sugar. Sounds like quite a lot, but it's gonna taste really good. Bring this to a boil like 10 minutes before you start to put your pickles into a jar so that you have that ready to go once the cucumbers come out of their salting and draining phase. So let me put this over here. We prep the jars. I'm using four cloves per jar. Then I'm going to use some juniper berries, like two per jar. And then, since these are mustard pickles, we need a lot of mustard. So it's like one teaspoon each jar of brown mustard seeds. You can make a variation of this. So the white or yellow mustard seeds are kind of mild and have good flavor. And the brown mustard seeds are hotter, so they bring a lot more of those uh, oils with them. Depending on how hot or not hot you want it, you can just use more of the yellow ones. Then I'm gonna add a few peppercorns. I do like tarragon, so I put some in. And then I put some onions in. And usually you layer those onions, so I put a few in the bottom and then I'll toss a few more in as we go with the cucumbers. Let's do two layers. So there we go, I put some extra onions in there. Of course, this works better the smaller you make the pieces, but I wouldn't make them too small because then they have no crunch whatsoever. Push them in a little. Maybe a tad bit more onions on top. Make sure you're not over the rim of the jar so that your jar can seal properly. We've got our jars all stacked. So now we need the brine. Boiling, if you please. And we do it like we always do it with all pickles. We just fill them up to the rim. That's it for the brine. Grab lids and immediately turn upside down. And now all we have to do is put them in the water bath at around 175 for, let's say 12 minutes. There should be enough water to about halfway up cover the jars. You don't want those jars floating up. Submerging the jars in it will get the level up to like three quarters of the jar and that's perfect. So the, you see the jar is still standing firmly. The temperature is at 182, a tad bit too high. It will cool down. The time is up. Let's go pull these out of the water. Put them on a rack or something to let them cool. 
And there you have them, German semi-sweet mustard pickles. If you enjoyed this episode, please like and subscribe, and I will see you next time.